Okay, this exercise comes from section 1.6, is uh, techniques for solving equations, and the strategy in this case for this equation is to see this as a quadratic equation, so we we'll try to write this as u squared plus b times u plus c equal to zero okay so let me rewrite this original equation in the following way so we want to see the first uh, term have a second power okay and so one way to write x to the fourth power is as x squared to the second power uh, and then we have minus 4x squared minus 77 equal to 0. Um, we're going to need the substitution. And you can tell by looking at this equation that if I let x be x squared, if I let u, sorry, u be x squared, this could be u, then we can write this as, so replace this parenthesis with u, this becomes u squared. And so, for every x squared that you see, you replace that with the u. Then that will give us this new uh, equation with u's that we can solve by factoring. So, this one we can factor as. Okay. Now, this one, the numbers are a little bigger than. Uh, other problems but uh, we can still factor it uh, the numbers uh, when you guys multiply and get uh, 77 or 11 and 7 okay uh, negative 11 and positive 7 so to solve it we set both parentheses equal to 0 and we have two solutions in terms of u so u equals 11 and u equals negative 7. Now we haven't finished. Um, if you start with the next variable at the beginning uh, with an equation that has excess, then you need to go back and do a replacement. So right here, to continue, we need to make a replacement. And so we're going to go back and replace u with x squared. Okay. So I'll go back to the original um, x squared. So this will give us x squared equals 11 and x squared equals negative 7. Now that you have x's, you can uh, finish the exercise. Uh, we're going to apply square roots um, to get rid of this. Remember that to put the plus and minus. So square root, square root, and then plus, minus. Okay, so um, here on the first equation we have x equals plus or minus radical 11 and here on the other side uh, this is x equals plus or minus radical negative 7 and as you, uh, uh, as you know probably by now in the homework my lab class wants you to use um, when it comes to radicals of negative numbers my lab class won't take this answer and up to plus one you to use complex number um, the complex number i so you can write this as radical seven times radical negative one and this becomes plus or minus radical seven and we all know that square root of negative one is i so these are our four um, solutions for this equation so the solutions uh, radical 11 negative radical 11 uh, radical 7 times i and negative radical 7 times i okay so that's the final